Abuha, great day guys. Welcome to TSA Toy Stash in Action with another toy review and I'm Ranger Dave and today we're gonna check out the Red Mighty Morphin Power Rangers from Lightning Collections by Hasbro and it's just insane guys and a big shout out for Walker Collections on you know helping us out to get this figure for this review. Now a quick history guys for the Power Rangers alright for basically the the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers they're essentially known as you know Super Sentai back in Japan and you know I have to thank you Saban for taking it over to America and you know converting them into Power Rangers now that's why we have them here and I'm totally happy and let's go ahead guys and check this figure out all right guys so here he is outside the packaging with its awesome red glory the red Mighty Morphin Power Rangers now I have to say guys you know first off it's completely awesome all right and the sculpt is just amazing you kind of get the likeness to it and uh, you know let's go ahead and check out the detail for the detail guys uh, the head sculpt all right and the paint wow well, for the helmet it's just insane I love it all right it's one of the best helmet and you know paint right here for that application I mean look at that those teeth the eyes and that you know mouthpiece is just insane so that is very well done kudos on that you know has bro and then you got here for the body and you know basically the entire scope right here is a little bit of Americanized all right uh, gawa ng hindi na siya uh, like they're supposed to be teenagers all right but they feel like you know there are older you know more adult power rangers because of their a little bit of a muscular tone on you know the entire detail of the sculpt but other than that that's just amazing you kind of get here the red power coin for the tyrannosaurus rex yeah i can't think of uh, you know anything that i can make it like you can see it right here but you know that's basically it there's a red power coin right there and then going here for the gloves you know basic pattern for that triangular you know pattern right here going here for the boots same thing you know you got that plain thing now uh the only differences between this guys that i don't like is you know the paint job for each and every what they call this joint all right because they own plastic now the plastic feels different when it comes to the joints like here for the hinge uh right over here at the top Iba yung plastic, right? So it's a different plastic, it's a different texture. Then going here, it's all glossy. Here it's matte, here it's glossy. So that's a little, bit, a little bit of a bummer. But other than that, I love it. Next up is, you know, his accessories. So this is the Red Power Ranger, you know, power sword. So that's what you get. And you also get this lightning, you know, effect right here. So this is a blue. So this is a very soft pliable plastic. You take it off and then you get the power sword. So yeah, maganda naman. Sculpt. I really wish that my camera can focus that you know a little bit better so you can see the power coin right there you know you can't see the t-rex over there but that's what you get and then you get two extra hands and so as you can see this one's a little painted go on and I've been putting it you know right here for the weapon you know I have to point that out as well that the paint does chip off every time you try to apply the weapon right so that's a little bit of bummer as well but other than that you get these two hands and then you got the blaster yeah and so there is the blaster so minimal paint job you got silver and then you got that plain red same as uh, you know for uh, the power ranger paint but this is the main thing guys you got jason's head over here so that is insane i love it and you gotta get it here now and get the likeness they got the likeness for jason on its head sculpt so that is insane all right guys now putting the accessory you got right here the power sword i did put up you know the lightning effect right here so that you can see it now i'm gonna start off with the hands all right so for the hands guys you got double fist right here and then you could pop this thing and then just apply you know his regular hand right here the grasping hand and then you can make him hold the power sword right there so it's very easy again guys i will point out that you know paint chips all over the black handle will you know go to the hands so that's a little bit of bummer but you could get that sword right there you got the power ranger blaster over here right so that's very easy and then you could put it right here at the side so you can have them you know holding it or you could take off this other hand right here try to pop it out 
and then just apply the other hand right here and then make him hold the gun you know or the blaster right there so that's you know basically those two and then of course you could apply the Jason head right so that's beautifully done now all you need to do for the Jason head guys is just you need to pop up the Red Ranger head there you go that's so it's very easy and then you just need to put and apply the Red Ranger right here try to get that there inside there you go and then you got Jason's head at there so that's pretty easy okay and it's really really awesome that I could keep the helmet as is you know it doesn't pop up you know basically like this and it's completely on scale so that's very nice alright guys now for the articulation which is our favorite part so I know that I do it but this is just insane for the head guys you got a bow joint alright so you can move it around rotate it you like up down so that's pretty insane I like that for the arm you can raise it up about this high so that's basically it and then you got that butterfly joint right here similar to Marvel Legends you got bicep swivel around here double jointed here at you know the elbow so that's pretty insane and then you got a hinge right here for the wrist also there is this you know it does swivel around here because it this does peg out right you know you could take it off and take it in so that's the articulation on that wrist and then you got a bow hinge right here for the upper torso so pretty pretty nice articulation you know move side to side very nice doesn't have any waist articulation though but it does crunch right here for the lower waist yeah and so that's how far it goes can go up that far so that's you know at least it's okay so that's what you got you also can make him do the splits about this far so that's okay and then you got thigh swivel right here double jointed here at the knees and then you also have a boot cut over here a hinge here for the ankles and it does have ankle pivot no boot cut or anything right here but you know that's basically it you could also raise his entire leg up about that much and then you can go about that further at the back so that's because of the scope of the butt but that's basically it guys so completely a lot of articulation all right a lot of improvements for all of the other previous power rangers you know that i've seen for the figures because it's just like this articulation all right guys so a quick size comparison i have him here next to the naruto figure you know from the anime heroes and also a marvel legends iceman figure now I, the reason why I've actually put them up next to this lightning collections, right? Because this is Hasbro, right? And it's supposed to be like this, all right? You know, the skinny type of Power Ranger because they're teenagers. You know, that's why I pulled up the anime heroes Naruto. He looks very teenager looking. But if you go around here for, you know, the Hasbro version wherein, you know, you got that much more defined musculature uh, type of, you know, body. Uh, they did it here right? it's a little bit of a mix okay for the lightning collection power ranger so that's a little bit you know on the good side so but yeah now you can see it here that there are symbols you know basically for the articulation but other than that guys I'm still happy with you know how it turns out so that's all right all right guys so that's my take for the lightning collections red Romani morphin power rangers from hasbro it's totally awesome i love the scope you know it's just completely insane the head scope for both of the heads for jason is just awesome the paint job is really really bugging me right now parts <laughs> you know it's matte and then they have parts that you know you got that gloss paint so that really bit of a bummer but other than that you know i really love it when it comes to articulation waist articulation it would have been nice if that's another but uh, i am giving this figure guys a four out of five rating you know and it's just awesome and i hope you like this video guys and if you are new to the channel guys please do hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell to be updated on every new video we have here and yeah remember guys life is one big collection peace out god bless